How did you get the news that the king was ill? Um, I spoke to him. And what did you do next? I jumped on a plane and, and, and went to go see him as soon as I could. Prince Harry was ready to end the royal rift in speaking for the first time since his father's cancer diagnosis. What's sort of your outlook on his health? That stays between me and him. An illness in the family can have a galvanizing or sort of reunifying effect for a family. Is that possible in this case? Yeah, I'm sure. But the big headline after four years in California is that the Duke of Sussex, who is fifth in line to the throne, is considering becoming a U.S. citizen. Do you feel American? Uh, do I feel American? Um, no. I don't know what, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know how I feel. Would you I, think about becoming a citizen? It's, I have, I have considered it, yeah. What would stop you from doing it? I have no idea. It's certainly not something that's a high priority for me right now. Harry's focus, right now is building buzz with Meghan for next year's first ever Winter Invictus Games in British Columbia. The couple held hands and check this out. Meghan took video as Harry raced downhill head first at 61 miles per hour on a skeleton sled. Oh man. Well done. Meghan, you gotta go. No way. Harry told ABC News he plans to visit his family in the UK as much as he can, but he's definitely loving life in the States. The kids are doing great. The kids are growing up like all kids do very, very fast. Um, they've both got an incredible sense of humor and you know, make us laugh and keep us grounded every single day. I'm just very grateful to be a dad. The couple's three-day trip ends today, Sunday. Harry's AR Strange Big Brother has a big public appearance. Prince William will attend the BAFTA Film Awards in London solo as Kate continues to recover from abdominal surgery.